staying with Maharashtra, but let's get you some political developments that are coming to the fore. And this is over the cabinet expansion in the state. Final allocation details uh, seem to now be coming out. This, of course, is uh, the side of the NCP or the Ajit Pawar camp that has come out and said that a decision has been taken and allocation of portfolios has been done. So far, there has been no confirmation that has come to the fore from either the Shinde camp or from the BJP. But what we're learning now is that after several rounds of talks and ironing out differences, now we're dis it is decided what portfolios NCP MLAs that were sworn in recently will be getting. We're now learning from our sources within the Ajit Pawar camp is that Ajit Pawar is going to get the finance uh, department. That is something that was uh, finalized even before the swearing-in took place. That is something that goes to Ajit Pawar. Those details, uh, that confirmation in fact from Ajit Pawar's camp coming to the fore. Dilip Valse Patil expected to get uh, minority affairs. Uh, cooperative, I beg your pardon. Hasan Mushrif is going to be getting uh, minority affairs. Uh, we have more details of what Chagat Bujbal and uh, Aditi Tatkare are also expected to get. Vinaya, my colleague, uh, joining us, getting us more details on that. Now, Vinaya, we have these details that are trickling in of who gets what portfolio. But this, again, is only coming in from the Ajit Pawar camp. There is no confirmation as such, if I'm not mistaken, from either the BJP or from uh, the Shinde camp. You're absolutely right. And in fact, that is exactly what the government sources seem to be telling us to wait and watch because we have seen how the developments in this government have taken place where uh, we have believed that plans have been finalized in the last minute and then they get called off. Something happened with uh, the cabinet expansion as well, wherein we were told that it would happen soon. And now it is quite clear that it has been postponed indefinitely. It uh, looks to be that the portfolio allocation that the NCP sources have told us is likely to happen with the nine ministers who have been sworn in with the Maharashtra government. There is no official word about it as yet. There isn't yet the official portfolio allocation with respect to this and that is why uh, we will have to wait and watch on whether uh, it is the same list that we will be able to see in uh, the uh, government resolution that will be published any time in the day today or whether it will uh, see some changes as well as of now we have seen uh, that uh, you know it's quite clear that ajit pawar will go ahead with finance portfolio something that we have been saying from day one and something for which there were clear cut reservations uh, from the shinde camp as well uh, but as of now, we are learning that the cooperative department, which is another key department, uh, will be uh, likely taken up by the Lipkoise Patel. Uh, the minority affairs uh, department will possibly go to Hassan Mushrif uh, uh, himself uh, from the minority community, somebody who has been winning uh, from uh, that seat for quite a while. Uh, Baba Atram likely to get transport, agriculture. Uh, is likely to go to Bhujbar, but again, Bhujbar has been asking for, uh, you know, some other portfolio. Uh, we will have to see if that uh, conversation also fructifies. As of now, we've been told that the list, uh, in terms of all the three leaders, has been finalized till late last night. But, uh, you know, we're still waiting for the official word on it. Now, remember Aditi Tatkare, who's the only female uh, in the entire cabinet. She is likely to get women and child development uh, when the list comes out. But as of now, as we are seeing, uh, through the list of all the nine ministers who have been sworn in uh, in the Maharashtra cabinet now, the NCP sources tell us that this is likely going to be the portfolio allocation. We will still have to wait for the government resolution in order to see if there will be any last-minute surprises in this as well. Uh, also to see which portfolios have been taken from which uh, party and have been given to whom. So we are expecting quite a few changes as well in that on that front too. So right. no official word, but uh, this is what NCP sources tell us. Back to you. Right, Bhavanya, just to put this in perspective, now we do know that the finance portfolio was with uh, the Deputy Chief Minister, the only Deputy Chief Minister until now, which was uh, uh, Devendra Fadnavis. So that is going to be reallocated to Ajit Pawar, to the NCP camp. But apart from all the, uh, apart from that, all the other portfolios which would be going to Ajit Pawar camp MLAs, are they the ones that are being reallocated from either the Shinde or the BJP camp or are these new allocations? Oh, well, of course they are being reallocated. Part of them are being reallocated from the Shinde camp as well. Take the example of agriculture. Agriculture uh, was with Dada Bhutte till now. Uh, we believe that that is being changed as well. Uh, maybe uh, transport, maybe uh, you know, minority affairs. There have been uh, departments that we have seen uh, are being moved about, uh, you know, from both the camps. So it isn't that there is. This is a fresh allocation. We have always known that 
there will be a reshuffling in terms of cabinet portfolios which will be taken from uh, both the parties kitties and there will be a de- redistribution on that front as well uh, so uh, while uh, we are awaiting some more uh details with respect to surprises which will be sprung in the official order we hear that uh possibly some of the sitting ministers will have to part with their key yes. portfolios but that is something we'll have to wait and watch for back to you and the assembly starts next week so perhaps this weekend is when that decision is finalized and the announcement is made do keep a track of that but for the moment vinaya thank you so much for getting us the latest